My name is Kennedy NG and I am very happy to present to you tonight our first program, the Dream City, Union City, New Jersey, which will be an option for the community to know the good things that happen in this beautiful city and to find out about positive changes and assistance programs that our community offers. It is an honor to be the host of this YouTube program that will be every Sunday at 7 p.m. We will have interviews with personalities who are the protagonists of this city being the city of dreams, Union City, New Jersey. You can contact us at 201-522-7722 or send us an email to kmwng at aol.com. I hope you all enjoy it. City of Union City, a cosmopolitan city where almost all of us have seen each other. We are like a large family that through the management of our representatives, they help our citizens. And our people do volunteer work because they know that the city is run by a mayor who has shown that he is not the common politician, but that he works for his community. This program is an extension of information where we are going to have participation of personalities from the public and private sectors so that they can keep us informed of the community. May that be educational activities and everything that benefits us. Good evening, my name is Kennedy NG, and tonight, the Dream City, Union City, New Jersey, we have a very special guest. Tonight we have Idalia Henaud. And who is Idalia Henaud? The President of the Union City Board of Education. Good evening, Idalia. How are you doing? Good evening. Thank you for inviting me tonight. Thank you. It is a pleasure to be here tonight. It is an honor for us to have you. I know you have a very tough schedule, very busy, and really... I really appreciate it. Tonight we're gonna be talking about education and a little bit about your background. Yes, uh, it's it's exciting to be here. This is my first time. <laughs> a little nervous, but I'm so glad that that I'm right next to you, which is very you. Good. You are one of the um, board trustee. You're doing very good. Idalia, can you tell us about yourself? Um, I'm a proud mom of a wonderful son, Robert, a dedicated wife of my husband, Sean. Um, I'm the daughter of fully um, Dominican parents, and I have seven siblings in total. I graduated... A very from, large family. <laughs> yes, I, it's a very large family. It's, we are four girls and three boys. It's a, it's a big family. Can, can you tell me a little bit about your educational background? Uh, I graduated from James Ferris High School and Hudson County Community College with an associate degree in early childhood education. Um, I'm currently working for our state senator, Mayor Brian Piestak, for 15 years, wow. providing uh, constituency services to our community. I remember the first day that, that I met you uh, in one of the offices. It was a pleasure. And yes, I remember that was a long time, like and look, two, tonight 2007, we, I think. And tonight we are here, you as a president and me as a host of the Dream City, <laughs> the Dream City Union City, New Jersey. You know that this program uh, we are doing it with the intention to provide the community uh, anything that could help our community, especially Union City, the Dream City. We are uh, like a large family, and having you in this show, I know that is an A plus. And I'm talking about information, and education, and anything related to the city of Union City. President Henao, can you tell me why it's important for you personally to be the president of the Union City Board of Education? It is a, a satisfying job um, to have the ability to shape the Union City Board of Education, not only for the students of Union City, but to share uh, the experience while my son is attending uh, Union City High School, uh, working with the board superintendent of school, uh, board council, board staff, um, 
board administrators and board trustees such as yourself. It is an honor and a privilege because you all um, are dedicated and committed to the students of Union City. Do you remember the day you were appointed as the, the president of the board? I was appointed um, May 2021 after our former um, board president, Janet Pena, retired, uh, who served the board for 18 years. She did an excellent job and we will continue to follow her philosophy. President Henao, can you tell me in what way can you motivate the Union City students in general to so they can they can continue in a higher education to, to go to college, universities and whatever they wanted to uh, to continue in a higher education. Important question. Um, I believe that motivation is start with making education fun and challenging, uh, setting goals uh, they can achieve and reorganizing their uh, accomplishment. Um, encouraging children to read more and complete their task assignment, um, embracing diversity, uh, discussing the importance of um, attending school regularly, participating in um, study groups, and discussing the importance of um, having a degree uh, in life. Daddy, you said before that your son is attending to Union City High School. Uh, do you motivate your son the same way you are telling the rest of the community to continue higher education, to, to, to go to college, university, or whatever uh, profession or career the, he wants to, to be in the future. Yes, I do. I, I usually encourage my son to read and to um, I encourage him to um, go to school regularly, which is very important. And um, the Union City Board of Education provide our after-school program, our recreation programs. The Union City Board of Education provides an equal opportunity for every child uh, to help them succeed. And that's very important. Yes. Our board, I'm part of the Board of Education for years, and uh, it is an honor to have Idalia as a president. Very smart young lady, which uh, she's bringing to Union City and to the Board of Education in general good ideas, um, a lot of things that we have incorporated into our district at school, specifically Union City. It's, it's like working as a family, it's a teamwork. We all work together, which is very important. Idalia, can you tell us, being a long time Union City resident, how can you describe the city of Union City, which I call it the dream city? Um, the city of Union City is, um, the way I can describe it, it's a united community led by our state senator, Emmanuel Brian Piestak, who worked tirelessly um, every day uh, to, for the well-being of our residents. I am a witness of that, I mean, walking out on the street every day when I leave my place of work. I can see at night time very bright. The lights. Light, the lights. A lot of police officers walking, patrolling, uh, taking care of the citizens, the seniors yeah. walking in a lot of new parks, uh, schools. And, and that's why we are sitting as a member of the Board of Education because we believe in that. Yes, he, the, our mayor has demonstrated um, to always care about his residents and to always put our children, uh, resident seniors first, future first, which is very important. Um, he's a great mayor um, and there is no word that we can describe what he does for the city of Union City. He's doing an extraordinary job. It's an excellent job. And the good thing is that we all know that every community in the state of New Jersey know about the city of Union City and because it's a large family with uh, one of the greatest uh, leaders in the state of New Jersey. And I would say probably in the country. Yes, I agree. I, I agree with you, Kennedy. It's, I believe he's the, the number one. And we can say in the entire, um, not entire, the entire country, but I could say 
one of the most uh, caring person that cares about seniors. Um, I, I work with him with fire victims, um, homeless prevention during the pandemic, helping constituent um, with food, with uh, rental assistant, PSNG, everything in general. Good, and, and I know that. Okay? Yes, and we are a witness. We witness that every day. President Henao, can you describe the Union City School District? The Union City School District is made up of uh, energized men and women who um, enjoy their careers and shaping our children's future. Uh, the district is ever involving with um, the state of art technology and upgraded facilities. I can say that I am a witness of uh, being also a board member. Uh, we try uh, every day to, to be better in general. Education, as a family, and anything that the children of Union City need, we are there to support the good ideas. Yes, and support children and family, which are the future. You, you got that right. <laughs> Italia, anything else you can add? Um, well, we we went through a lot during the pandemic, and I think um, it was a time of reflection for a lot of us. And um, we are into a point that we are getting better now. And thank God that we are, um, you know, we are almost at the end. I don't know if the end, but uh, almost we overcame the difficult situation that we went through. Yeah, yeah, just. And we are we are so um, thankful to God. Right now, we're doing better after vaccination, um, getting tested. Um, I mean, some people feel comfortable wearing the mask, and we respect that. A very personal option because personal you know, options, correct? And a family um, options. And we are continuing to follow the the guidelines, the CDC guidelines and protocol. Um, but we very thankful to God that we are doing better and we are continuing to do to, of doing better. President Henaud, uh, I really appreciate you spend some time with us. Sometimes we take it for granted that we know everything, but uh, the intention of this program, the Dream City, is to re-educate and to bring information to the city of Union City, the Dream City. I hope you enjoy this program and you can Watch the program next week, every Sunday at 7 p.m., The Dream City. My name is Kennedy NG. 